A local high school team celebrating a big win after going up against more than 500 teams in an international competition and coming home, get this, with the top prize. Tonight we're meeting some of the members who are riding a wave of success. These St. Francis High School students are diving deep into science and technology. This really made me fall in love with building things and making things. They're members of the school's robotics team called Genesis, and they've built this underwater remote operated submersible. Our robot is named Medusa. And no myth, Medusa and the team took the top prize in an international competition held earlier this month in Denver. When we heard first place, we were just, we were still in huge disbelief. To me, it was a surprise when our names got called. The robot is capable of diving more than 12 feet underwater and can be used for research purposes like addressing ocean pollution and climate change. Teaching us that there are real problems and they have solutions and that I can be a part of building them. Many team members want to continue their scientific studies once they graduate. I want to be an engineer. I want to stay in the realm of robotics and building things. There's a growing need for people with submarine skills. I think going forward there's going to be a huge demand for this type of study. There's very little we know about the ocean and it's constantly evolving. I think that there are so many unexplored things there and there's so many answers I think that we could find. And the tragic loss of the Titan sub and its crew shows there's still a great risk for humans conducting deep sea research. It shows that ocean exploration is a very unsafe thing and that robots are a good use. Well, the St. Francis Robotics team has been around for 25 years, but this is the first time they've taken the first place prize. Wow. Congratulations. Impressive. Yeah.